Our oceans are incredibly large, and throughout its vast waters, diverse life emerges. Here, colorful corals, lush algae, and countless fish enjoy the warming light of the sun. When we swim, fish, and steer our boats, we also enjoy these summer luxuries. But these things only scratch the surface of what lies in the ocean. As we dive deeper, the sunlight starts to fade away and things start to get weird. Fish look more alien than cute. Plants show off a color of bloody red and strange ocean structures form. Even then, we must still dive tens of thousands of feet to see what truly hides at the deepest bottom of the ocean. Once you descend to the deep ocean, a pitch black void of water surrounds you. Is it daytime? Nighttime? You would never know, and as you stay for longer, claustrophobia and isolation would be the only things on your mind. Not only is it dark and freezing cold to here, but the water crushes everything with extreme pressure. Somehow, life still finds a way to survive. Creatures emit light with their bodies to attract partners and to scare away predators. Some use their enormous eyes to see as much as possible. Others use sensitive touch to detect the tiny movements of any nearby creatures. Fish even turn invisible to hide in the darkness better. These creatures may have learned to navigate and hide well. However, just as easily, they are caught. They could try their best to swim away or hide, but these creatures would be instantly devoured by other marine monsters. With over 300 sharp and curved teeth, they hook their victims into their jaws. You could swim fast in the water, but it wouldn't matter if a giant squid gets a hold of you. They trap their prey with long tentacles tipped with extremely sharp tooth suckers, and on the ocean floor, enormous crabs ambush anything in its way. They snatch even the most defensive creatures with their powerful claws. Food is very hard to come by in the deep ocean, so these predators make sure that their prey can never escape. We are still only halfway down the Mariana Trench, and what lies even deeper is mind-boggling. At the deepest levels, huge valleys and trenches filled with black and spiky rocks dominate the ocean floor. The sheer size of it is intimidating. If you were to place Mount Everest, which is the tallest place on Earth here, its peak would remain underwater. To make matters worse, many submarine volcanoes erupt without any warning. As molten magna spews everywhere, it reacts violently with the freezing water. And when this extreme cold meets this extreme hot, an endless field of volcanic glass forms throughout the landscape. But beneath these valleys, trenches, volcanoes, and fields of glass is the deepest bottom of the entire ocean, the Challenger Deep. The water pressure here is so intense that your bones would instantly dissolve into nothing. So, as one of the most extreme places on our planet, what could possibly be here? From above, some kind of snow falls down to the bottom floor. Looking closely, the snow turns out to be small, white flakes made up of dead animal parts, fecal matter, and sea dust. Out of nowhere, something starts to eat it. Since life is so rare here, it seems to live with very little food and with no predators around. Usually, this creature would be extremely small in the regular ocean, but this special type grew to be quite large in order to survive. There's something odd, though. Inside its body, there appears to be colors of red, blue, purple, and even pink, almost like a rainbow. Scientists gathered samples of this and determined it to be something completely unexpected. Plastic. All the way down here, at the bottom of the ocean, where sea monsters were supposed to be, there was, instead, plastic waste from a washing machine. 
There are still so many creatures we haven't even discovered, and some of them may even be monsters from urban legends. With the endless potential of the ocean, however, the Mariana Trench is just one among many things that evoke infinite wonder. We hope you enjoyed our look into the bottom of the ocean. Do you think there are actually sea monsters there? Share your thoughts, suggestions, and questions in the comments below. Interesting new content like this is uploaded every week, so be sure to like and subscribe to see more of Infinite Wonder.